I'm really excited to welcome you today to Ethical Decision Making. This is one of the first courses that we've launched on our new sustainability hub. And it goes to the heart of being an engineer and being a professional. Sustainable thinking involves making compromises and trade-offs. And it's important that chemical engineers provide ethical decision-making principles when supporting the organisations they work in to become more sustainable. Decisions will never be simple. It's all good on the one hand and it's all bad on the other. Invariably, there'll be compromises and trade-offs and ethical decision-making is about making those compromises and trade-offs transparent. So the dis ethical decision-making course will provide some tools and insights and guidance to chemical engineers as to how to do this. Sustainable development is about trade-offs. Ethical decision-making is about making transparent those trade-offs and weighing up the full implications of decision before recommending a course of action. So I think ethical decision-making matters to chemical engineers because if we don't make ethical decisions, we run the risk of unintended consequences that may impact on people, may impact on the environment, or may impact on both. I think there's a long list of ethical dilemmas. Some of them are fairly well known and well written about, like the time, cost, quality, risk, trade-offs and variations on that theme. Some of them, depending on where you are, are emerging. So how well do you examine the supply chain of where you buy your goods and services for modern slavery, for example? How well do you examine the energy source where you buy your energy to make sure it is as sustainable as possible? How well do you design plant your equipment so that it can be dismantled and reused, or is it just single use? So there's a, a massive range of decisions that chemical engineers take every day or every week or every year that have an ethical dimension that would be enhanced by considering the ethics of those decisions more deeply.